Hello friends, welcome back. My name is Priyendra Kumar and in this video, I'll tell you how can you create a quick data entry form without using of VBA. Let's say I have this table wherein I have to enter some more records. So I'll select any record, click anywhere in the table and go to the form option. I'll tell you how can you add this form in quick access toolbar. So let me show you the form first. Click on form. So you can see all the headers are available here. Now, if you want to add new record, just click on new. Type the employee ID. Let's say I want to type 10005. Employee name as employee 5. Supervisor ID. Let's say I want to take 2002. Supervisor name. I'm just taking some dummy supervisor. Supervisor 2. Then process, let's say I'm taking process one. Designation, I want to keep here, let's say DM, duty manager, and salary, I want to keep 2500 and press enter. As soon as you will press enter, new record will be added in your table. You can see here, data is available. Now you can type your, again, employee ID and the complete record, then press enter, new record will be added automatically. If you want to delete any record, so to delete any record, you can use this uh, find previous and find next like this. And then you can delete. Let's say I want to delete this record for this employee. Just click on delete. You can see this data has been deleted for 10004 employee ID. All right, friends. But it may be best possible sometime you have a long list and if you want to find out a particular record, then you, of course, you will not use just this find previous and find next functionality because you have a long list of records. So what you can do, you can click on this criteria option and here you can input any criteria. Let's say I want to keep here this supervisor 2 id 20002 and i will press enter then it will give me the last record of this for this supervisor but then i can use this find next so next is not available this is the last one find previous now it will show the record only for that supervisor id all right, friends, let's say if you have some other criteria also, I want to find out wherein supervisor ID is this and employee name is employee 2 or employee 5. Let's say employee 2. Then if I will press enter, it will give me the values or the information for supervisor ID 2 and employee 2 both the condition will match then only it will give that value now i can update this information for example in process i want to keep uh, the process whatever i want to keep here let's say google and press enter then you can see this for 1002 the process has been updated as google all right friends so that's how you can use this data entry form this is very useful now I'll tell you how can you add this in your quick access toolbar or in new tab. So what you need to do, right click here and go to the customize ribbon or you can go to the file, then option and here you can go to the customize ribbon or quick access toolbar. So I have added this, this form. Let me remove this. So your quick access toolbar will be like this. And what you need to do, just click on this arrow and select command not in ribbon in drop down option. Now here, just scroll it down and go to the form. You will see a form option. Now click on add. So this option will be added into your quick access toolbar. Click on OK. So it will be available here. All right, friends. So you will click in your table anywhere and then 
click on this form option so it will be available all right friends so that's how you can use data entry form without using of vba in excel i hope you have enjoyed this video thank you so much for the watching